های everybody welcome to Persian with Farnaz. سلام به همگی به فارسی با فرناز خوش اومدید. I'm really sorry for I have a delay for producing a video, a new video because I was really busy. Uh, but right now I decided to uh, make some contents and try to uh, upload them regularly. Anyways, in this video I want to talk about the name of um, relationships and your relatives. Uh, for example, if you want to say father, mother, cousin, niece, nephew, um, sister-in-law, brother-in-law and things like that in Persian, uh, you will learn it uh, in this video. So watch it carefully, uh, like it and do subscribe. if you enjoy watching this video anyways let, let me start it uh, with a uh, picture that I've downloaded from the internet and yeah okay we have a photo here um, for example we have a father mother uh, their children and again the children of their children <laughs> and the children of the children of their children and um, I try to explain um, every word that I want to teach you in this video so just listen to me okay here uh, we have a father and if you compare it with uh, this kind of uh, these children you can understand that he is a grandfather and here we have a mother or grandmother for this children uh, in Persian for father we say pedar pedar and if you want to say it informally you have to say baba 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 is more common and in some families that you know some follow some difficult rules they say pedar or if you want to write it some somewhere down you have to say pedar instead of baba so pedar baba And for mother, you have to say mother for formal way of calling your mother and maman if you want to call her informally. Both of maman and uh, baba are respectful, so don't worry if you want to uh, call them maman or baba. As here in this photo, these two are grandfather and grandmother. I also tell you the word for grandfather and grandmother پدر بزرگ مادر بزرگ پدر بزرگ مادر بزرگ پدر بزرگ is, uh, is made by is made from پدر plus بزرگ بزرگ means ground and uh, پدر means father and again for مادر بزرگ we have mother or مادر plus uh, بزرگ Mother plus mother plus grand ground. Now we have their children and the relationship between their children. Uh, these two are wife and husband. These two and uh, maybe these two. Uh, okay. Uh, this is their son. This is their son. These two. Uh, for son, we have Pesar. Pesar. Pesar is, mm, you can use Pesar for both son and boy. So, don't make understand them. We don't have any any different word for saying son and boy. Just saying Pesar uh, is enough. They also have two daughters. Uh, for daughter, we say Dukhtar. Dukhtar. For girl and daughter, we, we just say Dukhtar. So, uh, Soleil is William and Jessica Dukhtar. Dukhtar William and Jessica. And Samantha is the same. All of them are married. Uh, so we have a sister-in-law for this daughter. and this other and we have a brother-in-law for uh, this uh, man and this um, girl and we have yes sister-in-law and brother-in-law this is like uh, the sister-in-law 
instead of telling sister-in-law for a married uh, man, we can say Zane Baradar. It is uh, Soleil, Soleil's brother. So we say Baradar. And his wife is Zane Baradar or Zane Dadash. Dadash is informal way of saying Baradar. Zan Dadash, Zan Baradar, Baradar, Khohar, Khohar. As you can see here, we have two sisters, two Khohar, Do Khohar. If your uh, sister is married with a man, uh, we have Shohar, Shohar. It means husband, Shohar. And this man is Shohar, Khohar. For this guy and this woman, Shohar, Khohar. It is Shohar, that means husband, and Khohar means sister, Shohar, Khohar, Zan, Baradar. And a wife means Zan. In Persian, we don't have um, this kind of relationships. Usually, we don't talk about these things. But uh, here, sister-in-law can be translated like uh, Zane. <laughs> it's really complicated. Zane Khohar. Hamsar Khohar. Hamsar is better. Hamsar means spouse. spouse. And so it's better to use here. Uh, now we have their children, all of them in, in English can be each other's cousin, but we have different uh, names in Persian. Uh, regarding the relationship between sisters and brothers and sister and brother, you know, uh, the name of their children uh, can be very different. But you can easily make uh, uh, composition of words for telling the relationship, relationship. just pay attention uh, if you are talking about your brother's children your sister's children uh, and adding a different word zade at the end of them you can make your appropriate composition for example uh, we have this girl and this man want to talk about this girl, for example. Uh, he can say, April is my khohar zade. Khohar zade. April is my khohar zade. So, for this man, April is his khohar zade. For this girl, or for this girl, this guy is baradar zade. We can say it differently too. Dochter Khohar. For this man or for this girl. Or Pesare Baradar. For these two sisters. Pesare Baradar. Dochter Baradar. Of course, I made a mistake here. I thought that this uh, guy is um, this man's son, but it's not true. They just have a, a daughter. But imagine that uh, he is uh, their son. Let me just tell you this relationship one by one. Uh, first, imagine that uh, this woman wants to talk about uh, these children. دختر برادر دختر برادر دخت... پسر خواهر پسر خواهر دختر خواهر دختر خواهر پسر دختر پسر دختر and we can say also Barodar Zode. Here we don't pay attention if she, if uh, she is a man or a woman. Barodar Zode. Just we pay attention that uh, she is that she is our brother's children or child. Sorry. 
خواهرزاده both of these are خواهرزاده for this uh, woman and all of these become نوه for this for Jessica and William نوه نوه or grand daughter or son we don't separate them by uh, their gender just we say نوه we also have two these two babies and this cat uh, that are the same uh, because they are also نوه uh, oh no not about this one uh, they are married and they have a child so uh, this baby is uh, Jessica's and William نتیجه نوه نتیجه sorry this one نتیجه so نیا is Jessica's and William نتیجه for learning more information about the relationships and relatives uh, you can also listen to my audio podcast on CastBox. Uh, its link is on the caption. You can find it easily, so don't worry. And if you have any question, uh, you can write it down uh, on the comments and I will reply you as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. Please do like and subscribe and uh, share the link of this video with your friends. Uh, have a good time. Bye-bye.